IIT Bombay is probably the top technical institute in the country and of course we have great strengths besides engineering in fields like humanities and social sciences, management, design and so forth and I think this whole thing synergizes very well and uh, you know in, in the institute we are creating an environment uh, where many different kinds of people can coexist and grow and essentially realize what their talents are. I would think IIT Bombay is one place which is bubbling with enthusiasm and energy, which cares for people, which is open to new initiatives and ideas, which collaborates extremely well and as I said, which permits even an ordinary person to do extraordinary things. To me, the integrity and freedom uh, are two great uh, values that I, the IIT, especially IIT Bombay, nurtured in me. And I'm not even mentioning the other things which are very well known. That is, uh, values like meritocracy, uh, values like uh, the desire for knowledge, pursuit of knowledge, pursuit of excellence. Um, the value of uh, maybe a lot of IITians uh, went on to do a lot of socially oriented things. So the value of a social conscience, the value of being a responsible uh, citizen of not just a, not just India but maybe a global citizen. Faculty, whatever little I know, faculty when I was there until six years, four years ago, I'm not in touch now. It's an outstanding faculty. That doesn't mean everybody is equally outstanding. Of course not. But a large number are very, very good and committed. We're not working only for money. We work because of India, because of IIT, because they love teaching, they love research. I mean, it just amazed me to see that uh, there were people who were good at music, good at sports, good at academics. And, uh, you know, so I mean, it also uh, sort of forces you to develop other dimensions. and. Uh, you know, so everybody actually benefited from that. Those five years in IITB has been, I think, a hallmark of my shaping of my career, my thinking. Those were the in front of the main building lawns, we used to sit and dream of future, uh, what we can do, what we want to do, like to be on your own, be an entrepreneur, those kind of, I don't know from where, but with a group of friends and all that, we keep on discussing. Well, we're very fortunate at the IIT to be able to attract some of the best minds in India. I believe to compete against and to be rated as the very top institutions in the world, we must be driven by an overriding desire at every level to be the best in everything we do. That's at the institute leadership level, it's at the faculty level, at the student level, and at the alumni level. Earlier, if someone came back from abroad, he had a limited number of places. The person had a PhD in, say, science or engineering. There were a limited number of places that person had. Now there are many more. Many more places, many more research labs, many more research centers where these persons of talent are needed, are attracted, and probably offered a lot more also in terms of compensations for their efforts. So the challenge of recruiting new faculty continuously. It's not something that starts and ends tomorrow. It's a continuous process. It will always remain a big one for this institute. So I think we really need to do something to build build a great research program and increase dramatically the, the research and both the output of the research and the and the, the quality of the research. So that's one area clearly I think this is. There I think it's worth identifying a few areas we want to take global leadership in because you know building 
a world class capability in any area requires you to attract uh, great researchers great professors then they in turn attract great students you need to invest money in them research programs take many years to del deliver results so i think we need to identify a few strategic areas which are important for the world and most importantly important for india governments come and go directors come and go faculty come and go but we will always be alumni and this is where we come from and this is what we will always be associated with so i think the importance of making sure that the iit thrives and grows and reaches the top 20 is a challenge that all alumni should take and i think one of the things that we can do contribute with our ideas contribute with our money contribute in a focused way and stay involved because that's what's going to drive this institute forward And if it does go forward, I think it will benefit all of us.